The Wenatchee Apple Sox dropped back-to-back -back home games for the first time this summer as the Bellingham Bells came on the road and took two or three at Paul Thomas Senior Stadium with a 6-5 victory on Thursday night. Wenatchee trailed 2-0 heading into the bottom of the fifth inning and got RBI singles from Reeve Boyd and Frankie Carney to tie it up, but the Bells immediately had an answer, scoring twice in the top of the sixth and then again in the eighth and the ninth innings with insurance runs. The Apple Sox trailed by four going into the bottom of the ninth inning, but refused to go down quietly, scoring three runs. However, the final out of the game was recorded over at third base with Wenatchee within one run, but the, of course, they would not get an opportunity to play potentially the tying run. Samuel Round picked up a no decision, but the incoming of freshman at Gonzaga was brilliant on Thursday night. Five innings, he allowed three runs in that time. Two of them were earned, and he struck out 10 hitters to become the second Apple Sox pitcher this season to record double-digit strikeouts as a starter. What actually looks to get a new streak going on Friday night as they welcome the Edmonton River Ox into town. It's Aloha weekend. going to be a fun weekend of baseball including with Saturday's game being the Apple Sox annual free trip to Hawaii giveaway night with first pitch for Friday and Saturday at 635 and then Sunday at 105 p.m. With your Apple Sox update, I'm Joel Norman.